mammals. We've all heard about them. A few of us have probably even seen one. But what are mammals? Where do they come from? Also known as milk suckers or milk lizards, mammals are a highly derived group of synapsid reptile. More specifically, mammals are therapsids of the cynodont variety. The milk lizards are one of only two major groups of endothermic or warm-blooded reptile, the other major group being the dinosaurs or avian reptiles. Milk lizards and all other reptiles can be distinguished from their fellow tetrapods or land fish by the fact that they lay their eggs out of the water. When they lay eggs, that is. In contrast with their fellow warm-blooded reptiles, the dinosaurs, the majority of mammals appear to have broken from tradition by abandoning the time-honored oviparity of their ancestors in favor of the far more obscene viviparity, excreting their vulnerable young completely unprotected directly through the birth canal, sometimes into a pouch or incubator of some kind. Like their fellow warm-blooded reptiles, the dinosaurs, Milk lizards are very often coated in a soft, filamentous covering, increasing the likelihood that they will be spat out by predators. The most distinguishing characteristic of mammals is the delicious and nutritious lactose-rich mucus, which they use to nourish their young and excrete through pores in their skin that are evolutionarily modified sweat glands. This lactose-rich mucus isn't just food, however. Laced with a highly addictive neurotoxin known as oxytocin, this mucus is used to ensnare their insidiously adorable offspring with feelings of love and trust and bonding. Since they first appeared on this earth, numerous diverse varieties of milk lizards have appeared. All of them rats. Rats with hooves have evolved numerous times. Rats with flippers have evolved at least three times. Once in the ancestor of whales and dolphins, who are together now known as cetaceans. Once more in the ancestors of seals and sea lions, also known as pinnipeds. Rats with wings have only evolved once. In the Choroptera, or bats. At least the winged rats have had the decency to remain monophyletic. There are also, of course, rats with thumbs. Famous examples include raccoons of the order Carnivora, chinchillas in the order Rodentia, and every known member of the order Primata, that is, lemurs and monkeys. They're a type of tree rat. Out of all the lineages of lactating land fish that we call the milk lizards, it is this latter group of lemurs and their kin that have caused the most trouble. For it was among this group mammalian in origin, primate in particular, that the world's first multicellular virus emerged.